This is the Big Brother Minecraft house. Twelve strangers are about to move in for a chance to win $500,000. With every movement captured by 35 cameras and every word captured by 104 microphones, there is no privacy inside the Big Brother Minecraft house. Every week, the house guests will evict one of their own until only one will be left standing to win the half million dollar grand prize. The house guests will fight for safety and, most importantly, power. With the eight new house guests moving in, the four returnees of the contested season will also move in as well. In 57 days from now, a winner will be crowned by the Big Brother Minecraft jury. Once after a certain point of the game, a house guest will become a member of the jury. It's summertime, America, and that will mean one thing. It's time for the Minecraft Season 1. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is the season 6. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you want to sip a oh, want to take a spot? Twist, the first nest that's in the certain right. seat wins the household. <laughs> yeah. Right, Let's go. go. There's totally seven house guests. Expected, expected. Anyway. Oh. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> So, the person on my left, which is Vinaka, aka Jake, you'll be going first. Roses are red, violets are blue. Uh, welcome to the house because I hate all of you. No, I'm kidding. I, uh, <laughs> hi guys, I'm Jay. I'm 15 from New Jersey, and uh, yeah, I'm just really hyped to play with you all. Thanks. Bye. Alright. Um, oh, I would be last. <laughs> Oh crap, who hit me? Alright, well, I don't care anymore. Alright, hey guys, my name is JP. Um, I do cross country track. And the bad thing about this game is um, I'm really slow in this game because I, I, yeah, that's me. The complete opposite of how I'm in track. And I'm, I'm pretty 15. I pretty much suck at any parkour, so don't worry about that. Um, wow. And stars. man, I, I'm ready to, I'm ready to break that five minute. I mean, uh, four minute and 55 minute mile that I already did. So yeah. Oh, good yeah. job. Nice. Thanks. Oh, I'm sorry. Sir. I apologize. Hello, I am MacArthur. Um, some of you may know me as Master Fi or Master Fi 24 Master or Master v. or whatever. I am 17 years old. I like doing YouTube videos, not to promote or tune my own horn. Um, <laughs> I like a lot of video games, and I like food. Thank you. And who Pokemon. Doesn't, who doesn't love food? I like Pokemon. Hello, my name is Kirby. I'm from Texas. I'm a soccer player and a uh, gamer. And I'm not British, goddammit. <laughs> oh, by, by the way, I'm, I'm secretly casted for season six. Get ready for that. Right. Oh, I would Hello, cast my name is uh, Danny. Uh, I'm from Wakanda, and I'm a digital oh. artist. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Alright. 
Hi, I'm from Canada. I'm 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 making I'm making I made up this country. Uh I am seventeen years old and I am am in a relationship with one of the biggest Minecraft YouTubers. Woo. Ooh. Wait, wait, who? who? One of them. Who? Uh, you guys will find out. Oh. Hi, my name is Timo, and I like Timo. Timo time! Lit! Lit, I'm the only one here. So, welcome to the first season. I hope you guys are ready, but I'm gonna let you guys talk for a little bit, and then I'll be reviewing the first twist of the season. Oh, wow. I'll let you guys talk. Hi, guys. Yeah, um, guys, yeah, I think we should form this, like, secret alliance of the, the we're gonna be called the Three Musketeers, I, I believe in us. Yes, I think that I'm getting really good vibe off you. Oh, man, we yeah. all got the swag, man. I'm sorry for this. We need <laughs> a hashtag. Wait, need wait, a hashtag. wait, 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 wait. MacArthur, do you do track and field? I'm uh, sorry, but I do not. I am not. No, oh, we could have been track stars. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, we could have been like, the track stars. Okay. You, know what? Okay. you know what? What I think it might be a little bit better. I think because we're in the jungle room and we're the only three here, we should be. We're the monkeys. Three. Okay. I was going to say that. Okay, that could work. The three, three, the three, three monkeys. No monkeys jumping on the beds. Wait. Oh my god. <laughs> the three monkeys jumping on the beds. Five little monkeys. <laughs> yeah, because like, I feel like this cast will be like one more like vibrant, like more exciting cast. Uh, so I'm going to just I'm going to, like spend like some time looking around the house. If you want to follow me, sure ahead. You can go do that. I'm just gonna stay in here and see who wants to talk to me. Oh, okay. That's nice talking to you. Yeah, for real. Alright. Uh, like, I'm just sitting right, real, I'm snuggled right in there. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. So, Killer, what do you think about all the others around here? Uh, I don't know, like, a few of these people. I don't know you that well, Kirby. I don't know JP or Jay that well. I really don't know many people here at all. I never really talked to anyone around here. But yeah. I can just kind of a few people. I can feel like I feel like that that they're kind of out to win. And some of them feels like they're just here to have fun, but and aren't really going to be that. But some of them you can mm -hmm. tell they're just trying. They're just more going to be the ones that are going to be. Gonna That's like true. Them. Yeah. I just have to tell by how they do in challenges, though. Mm hmm. I am very confident in the challenges because I do build my own survivors. And I do practice them like 24-7, like my own challenges. So I feel a little bit confident in doing that, but yet I don't think I am the best in challenges. So I'm, we can always see. I'm I'm kind of worried about the those three in there. Those three oh, in yeah. there. Seems like they're probably already in a lot. In a majority. Yeah, in a majority. Yeah. It's kind of concerning. I honestly don't think there's just seven of us. This, this is probably not just seven of us. I feel no. Like... Just looking at the memory wall. Yeah, like look at the memory wall. There's like a bunch there's, of like wither skeletons. These people already blacked out. That's kind of highly suspicious. Yeah, that is. Hi. Hi. Look up, look, look up sitting with us. Hello. Sit, sit like right there. Like, get snuggled in while huddling up, while cuddling each other. Uh, I'm gonna go get a donut. <laughs> okay. Um, All right. Um, no, no homo though. No homo. Yeah, no okay. homo though. Yeah, we've got to mention that. No homo. Uh, <laughs> so we just we just been talking around. Pretty much week one. It's pretty lit, man. I gotta say that it was fun. Um, so I got this huge gang together. We call us the Three Monkeys Jumping on the Bed. It's me, Masterfy, Jay, and then me and Jay have a secret final two alliance, which is called the Track Stars. So pretty much, I'm feeling confident going into this week. But then, what do you know? Someone's already targeting me and Jay because they saw they were talking a lot together. And of course, it has to be Kirby. That's why I think he should go home next. If I want HOH, Kirby is one of my targets. But like, then again, I haven't talked to the team on that much or any, so I really don't know where their heads at. Heads are at, and, I, and then I know they're good players. So pretty much, my goal is to if Timo wins H the next HOH or the first HOH, I think that he aligned with them. Because because if I can get him on my side, we should have a huge power alliance, and then when we get the chance, we can take Timo off. Well, there seems to be some alliances forming already. I believe I'm gonna be aligned with Kirby.
Kirby. I'm going to try to bring him to the end. He's going to be my ride or die. He's probably be the only person who would be loyal in this entire cast. And the memory wall is definitely suspicious with just five blank uh, skulls on it. It just gives me bad vibes that there are more people that are going to be in this, involved in this game. But right now, I see many people forming alliances, and it seems like me and Kirby are going to be in the minority. And you know what? That's okay. We're going to have to fight it out, and that's how most people in Big Brother win. So let's just get it down and dirty. Yeah, I think it's Star Wars. Because it's Star Wars. Star Wars? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Mike, yeah. I'm stupid. I got to get in there. All right, guys. Honestly, though, uh, if, like, little, if, like, Timo or someone wins, that would probably be our, our best goal. It's, like, to start aligning with him. Like, we should talk align with him early because I know he's going to come. And, so, and I, I could see him winning. So we, so we should start aligning with him. So you're thinking that maybe we can get Timo as, like, a dwarf, like, a, like kind of, like, in the outer circle? I mean, kind of yeah. easy. Like, kind of, like, kind of, because we need, if, if he does, I can, I believe he won the first comp. That's almost guaranteed, because he's really good at comps. We should, okay. we need to kind of, we need to kind of, like, use him to be safe. You know what I mean? Okay, so we can, all right, I could definitely try to talk to Timo and see, like, what's up with him. But the problem is, is that what I'm worried about is, like, it's us three versus Killer, Kirby, Timo, and then Kiwi. This is what I'm yeah. About. Are we That's sure? What I'm about. Are, we, are we sure it's the three of us against all of them? No, but look, they're like they're talking to each other more than us, and that's yeah, what that's I'm worried true. about. And so what I think we need to do is we need to definitely, like, one of us we have to win if mm -hmm. we can. Yeah. And well, then, it looks like we could definitely talk to Timo and say, mm -hmm. hey, if you if we keep you, you know, we could definitely, you know, cause some damage or whatever. But definitely, I want us three to stick together for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we just have to make sure that one of us three wins the pedophile competition because we need to make sure that the numbers are even. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Should we, talk, should we talk to Danny? He's like alone in the backyard. He might yeah. like... We could, we might be able to sway Danny as a fourth and fifth. Like, would you rather he's just there. Well, here's the thing though. We can't, he, I feel like he, it's kind of like a choice. We either have to sway either Timo or Danny or something. That's yeah, but... We have to get Timo alone because Timo, honestly, I think would be a better option because he, I think he's, I don't, what he's like more. Doing? He doesn't really. Hi, talk killer. Me. Hi. Mm. I'm good. Boy. Wait, we're in the star room. If you want to come. Yeah, I know. Yeah, come to star Hi. room. Hi. Hi. Are you gonna, are you gonna change here. your vest? Okay, so this is my bed. Okay, so what are you thinking, killer? Uh, so far, like I don't, I feel like it's too early to assume like anything. Yeah. Even though it's like this, I know this is. Yeah. We, ha we know there's a fifth coming. Yeah, it's gonna be, definitely it's bound to be more, house, more guests. house guests. Yeah, there's bound to be that's, more that's house guests. That's a fact. That's a fact. I know that. Yeah. Okay. We gotta be. So, and I'm saying this right now. Kirby, a little bit sketch about this setup right here, like between you, Jay, and uh -huh. JP. Oh wow. Yeah. But, oh really? Wait, everybody's sketched. About, wait, who's no, sketched? No, no, wait, Kirby. Kirby is. Kirby. Kirby. Oh, oh wow. Well. So, going into the house, I've seen this beautiful room. I'm like looking around, like, wow, oh my god, wow, 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 look at that thing. That doesn't look normal. This book is cast. Like, like it's, it's the same as Big Brother things. In this game, I want, to, I hope to uh, win the most competitions because I am, I am a very competitive person. Then, all these people in this house are not going to beat me in this competition unless it's the A choice that I'll, after my week. I'm being a choice because then I can just throw it to them because I'm not even in the that competition. But yeah, if these people were smart, they would probably target me fairly early on because of my physical prowess. Because they don't, because I did tell them that I I host survivors and I practice my comps like 24/7. And so those people have to look out for me because I'm ready to play week one. And but yeah, and the whole house is actually thinking that there might be more cat like people here. Like seven people, really, Bob Sir. Seven people isn't good enough to be in a, your first season. That there's bound to be twelve because it's twelve spots in the memory wall. Oh, but I just gonna sit back, relax for now, talk to everybody at least for like five minutes, and da da da. Gonna see what these people are all about. I'll really have to do. Right now, I'm definitely playing kind of a very, um, a huge social game. 
Um, so I'm just trying to get along with a lot of people. Um, but my game is going to be, I guess, sort of a school game because, I mean, I have my final three with JT um, and Shay. And, but then I also have, like, this thing where I am talking with Danny. And basically what we're trying to do is get information from both sides of the house because right away it's definitely clear from the very beginning that it's four versus three. It is me, JT, and Jay on one side versus Timo, Hitler, Kirby, and Danny on the other side. However, I'm trying to talk with Danny and see if maybe we can, I guess, play both sides of the house and come after one another. And I definitely need to make sure that the other side of four gets down one number so that way at least it's a bit even on both sides. And on top of that, if Danny is trying to snake me or try to lie to me, then I can still fall to my other two and pretty much still work with them. Kayla walks into the star room and basically talks about how Kirby is pretty much sketched out about JT and Jay being close with each other and talking to each other a lot at the very beginning. And honestly, I feel like it's a little bit of strategy. You know, I think that Killer is playing the game hard right from the beginning, as am I, so I can respect that. But I feel like he is pretty much trying to have the three of us go after Kirby before we go after Killer. But that only makes me want to go after Killer first, because I feel like Killer is just trying to manipulate and trying to strategize, and I'm just not down for it. The only person that should be strategizing and the only person that should actually be manipulating is this guy right here. So Killer, you better watch out, because I'll make sure one of my allies gets rid of you before you even have a chance to cause me damage. Everyone, please make your way to the living room now. <gasps> Finally! Oh Thank oh freaking God. God. All right. Dex, do not join chat yet. All right. So as you notice, uh, wait, is everyone here? No. All right. Um, uh, everyone, please sit down. So apparently, um, we got a new house guest that will be joining you this season. Ooh. Would our special guest please come oh. from the DR? It's Andrew Yellow. It's Andrew Yellow. Andrew Yellow. It's Andrew Yellow. Come on out. Everyone, please say hello to Deck. Hi, Deck. He'll be joining you for the season. Hi, but Deck is not the only one that will be joining with you. As you know, you guys may be wondering why there are only four skulls on the wall. Oh. Deck, please shut the um, DR real quick. D DR door. Sorry. Um, there you go. Okay, Deck, please have a seat. Deck, Deck, Deck. Please have a seat. Please have a seat. So, you guys may have remembered the tested season that was supposed to have been on my channel. Oh, no. Let me tell you this. The four house guests from that tested season will be joining you for this season. And they are no familiar they are no strangers to you guys. So I'm about to invite them in right now. I miss the sheep. We are good sheep. Uh oh. Alright, alright. Um this thing on. Alright. So so uh, all the newbies, we noticed that there's a lot, lot of spaces on the mountain, um, and we know that there's vets coming in, but we don't know from where, because this is the first season. Well, we're thinking it might be, like, all-star players from other series, which would really hinder our game, so JP and I go around and try to align all the newbies pretty much and pretty much try to take out the vex because we know that if they are vets from another show or another big brother like andrews or something then they could actually put a do a number on our game and i think that the eight of us we can unite and we can take them out please say hello to digi Lozy. 
smooth, and charged. So I finally get another ch chance after the test season to return. I'm su super excited about it. I didn't do too well in the test season. I got 12th place, which is out of 13, so I only survived one week. So I'm super excited to be back. I can't wait to start playing the game and showing everybody that I am, have learned from my past mistakes. So I'm back in the house, and this should be a good time. My second chance, I'm ready to steamroll all these bad players. And what I'm going to do is just win this game. I'm not focused on anyone. I'm just going to make a power line, some backstab all of them, and I'm going to win the game that easy. It's time for the first head of household competition. Everyone, make your way to the backyard right now. So, welcome to the first head of household competition. Alright, alright. So, this is Mining Frenzy. Here's how it's going to work. When I say go, you'll be grabbing a diamond pickaxe and a lever that was, that's in the chest, and you'll be mining the ores that is in front of you. You must be the first person to be at the redstone lamp before the others. What? Once you do that, make sure you type done in chat. I'm going to put the line kind of like this. Oh, wait, kill you're not. Wait, wait, where's the button that marks down? Like, how do we get light up? You're going to, uh, you're going to, there's a lever in the, in the chest. Alright, that's supposed to be an ant that you got in the chest. Yeah, because um, it'll make things a lot um easier. Oh, wait, so you're saying it's not I said before all you didn't kill her. Stop doing it. Anyways. After the first, after the first round, um, then we'll go to the second round. We'll only contain right, six. Cool. The first person who does it quickest, does it the quickest, will be the first head of household of the season. Does everyone understand? Ooh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So to make things fair, I'm gonna have, well, I'm gonna do this. Oop, I almost fell from this. Smooth. Yeah. You'll be playing. Uh, oh no, I'm scared. Against. Killer. It's gonna be another returning. Don't you dare, killer, 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 stop. Oh yeah, because it's late. It's gonna be another returning. <laughs> yeah, to make it fair. Maybe this is the tiny. Yeah. yeah. You will be playing again. There we go. Don't go, don't go yet. Hey, shut up. Are we allowed to take this stuff out? Not yet, not yet. Lulzy. You. I will speak. Are going to be facing. Why am I telling you you're facing killer? Oh, hey. No, you got, all of you are going to be there, so, hold on. Oh, Jay. that's not how it worked the last time. <laughs> well, I decided to mix things up. Why did crash? <laughs> Here, hurry, get Dak in there. <laughs> hey, Dak! Just start the around. <laughs> Please don't crash on me this time. Dak, you'll be facing against, um, Jay. Okay. Is this a yeah, please do not open the chest, please. Um, Timo, what if I told you that you'll be facing against Kirby? Oh, okay. The weather is being a. What am I facing? The weather. Facing uh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Master Fox. MacArthur, excuse me. What if I'm told, telling you you're facing against Digi? Which means, in no particular order, Danny and Charge will be the last two. Danny and Charge, right beside each other. Wow. All right, everyone, please stand on behind the chest. Let me put the line in. Okay. Let's see here. Dan
Danny. Jay. Oh, I'll count as killer um, for that one. So, killer it is moving on to the next round, which means Lulzy, you have been eliminated. Danny. Okay, he is moving on to the next round. Charge, you have been eliminated. Um, Jay, who are you facing against? Who are you facing against, um, Jay? Deck, okay, Jay, you moving, you moving on to the next round. Deck, you have to win. Timo and Kirby. Um, wait, Timo was done first. Right? Wait, Timo, you were facing against Kirby, right? Okay. Timo, you be moving on to the next round. Kirby, you have been eliminated. Yay! Okay, so, um... MacArthur, who do you face against? Digi? Uh, he won. He made me. Alright, Digi, you have been eliminated. Mac no. MacArthur, you, you are moving on to the next round. So, whoever's elim eliminated, that's said, please have a seat. Wait, JP, you're out? Oh, you lost to Smooth. Alright, so Smooth, Killer, Jay, Timo, Danny. Oh, wait, who was right? Who was right here? Hey, Garthar. Yeah, I had, like, it said something like. Alright, I'm going to make it random, because I'm about. Actually, I'm going to decide, um, who is going to be, um. Who you're next to Actually, I'm going to do a number. So, whoever's eliminated, please be quiet. So, the six people. I'm going to do a number from 1 to 10, and I have the number. So, smooth. What is the number? The number is totally 4. <laughs> because Killer. Eliminated. What? Number 1 through 10. Uh, my lucky number 9. J? 7. Timo? I choose either one, one through ten. One through ten. Which number is one, it? I chose one. One. Yeah. MacArthur, even though you're invisible. Is he deafened? No, you know. Oh, MacArthur. Pick a number one through ten. Um, has five been chosen? No. Oh, I don't I think, think five was picked. I picked five. All right, Danny. Yeah. Three point one four. It has to be numbers one through ten. The the, the so dots will not count. It's five. It's five. So the Three. number that I picked <laughs> is <laughs> five. So MacArthur, you're the first H O H. Master, I I know that we've not had much time in this house, and I just hope. That you know that our alliance is called the one and only, the three monkeys jumping on the bed. They must live, and that we cannot vote each other out because us, we need to stay here. And because, like, we need to take out those bigger targets. Like, I know, like, right now, we have to worry about who is going to, like, help our game. Like, I don't think, like, him, like, already targeting me and Jay, I don't think that's going to be good for our alliance because we need everyone here. So I think Kirby would be a good one for us to go out first. But, like, also, like, other options might be, like, people like, uh, who else? Um, like, Danny. I don't really know. I don't know besides that. And that he could definitely be a good person to get out in the future. And, like, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm really too bad about saying this, but, like, if it comes down to the wire, we're going to have to get some without him because he, I know he's a beast. <clears throat> oh. 
Oh, hi, hi, guys. Uh, oh. Hi. So, first, uh, I guess I'm just gonna, I'm gonna sit down and just talk. Uh, JP, you can stay if you want. I don't, I don't know. Fine. Uh, but right. I think uh, the three monkeys jumping on the bed. <laughs> um, obviously, I don't want to sit here and just beg for safety, but um, I think the three monkeys jumping on the bed needs to stay together. Um, we could run this game. And I know it's the first week, so you don't really have much to go off of. So I'm going to make a bold statement here. And um, if need be, I think you should put me up as a pawn next to a big returnee that's, like, good at comps or, like, a, a physical threat, social threat, strategic threat, or something like that. Because I think the vets are going to stick together. And I think we need to get one of them out. If if I were you, I would put up smooth, but that's just me because I think he's good at comps. And um, yes, I just I, if it need be, I'm not asking to go on the block, but if need be, I think you should put me on, up as a pawn next to smooth. Wait, wait, hold the fuck. You want to go on the block, dude? Like there are so many houses. Like Kirby for crying a lot. I don't even. We don't even know. Why should we on said? Because, like, I, I will win that veto. Don't wor don't you worry, JP. And if I don't win the veto, I have a few votes to stay because I know that you will you'll hopefully vote for me to stay. And I think um I don't know. I feel like the other newbies will vote to save me. And if veto is used on smooth, I think you should put up another vet, maybe like Digi. I don't know. But yeah, charge, but seems, like charge seems like a very good social threat too. That's why I made it to the end last time apparently. But. Yeah, if need be, I think you should put me up next to Smooth, because I think we need to send him home first. Yeah, and plus, I mean, I guess you're kind of right, like, well, like, then again, like, if Kirby, if we don't put a, like, if we put up Kirby, like, he doesn't win the comp, because we don't know how good his comp was, and, like, he, he can, like, just be, like, a liable person to put on the block as well. I mean, but, but if what? we put up someone, someone like Danny May, but, like, then again, we, 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 if he wins, like, the comp, then he might come for us, like, next the week. The worst case scenario would be that uh, somebody, like, Charge or Digi wins the veto, takes Smooth down, and then the only returnee left is Lolzy, and I feel like Lolzy we can work with. So if anything, MacArthur, I think if if Smooth gets taken down and we can't put up another vet, I think you need to put up Kirby because he thinks that the three of us are going to be a powered team. And honestly, he's right. <laughs> House guests, please come to the living room. All right, house guests, and congratulations to MacArthur for winning the first head of household. But his HOH will be cut short tonight. That's because one of you will be the first house guest to be evicted from the house tonight. Which means, MacArthur. Oh my God. You have a responsibility by naming two house guests for eviction. Oh my God. And the two house guests that you name will be facing each other in a competition where one of you will be safe and the other will be the first evicted from the house. So, MacArthur, please name the two house guests you're going to nominate for eviction. Okay, I have to go with Smooth and Jay. Alright, Smooth and Jay, please have a seat. Smooth and Jay, you both have been nominated for eviction. Where one of you could possibly be the first house guest to be evicted. So, right now, Jay and Smooth, make your way to the backyard for the, for the competition to begin. All right, hello nominees and welcome to a, a competition called Wool Relay Race. One of you will be going back into the game and you will be safe. The other will be evicted from the house. But here's how this, this challenge is going to work. When I say go, 
you guys will be going parkour on the iron blocks and try to get your wool. There are in the square that you're inside is the hole you have to fill in. The first house guest that fills in the hole with their wool will be safe from going home. The loser will be the first house guest evicted. You two understand. Mm. Alright. You two may begin in three, two, one, go. Has completed. Yes. Which means Jay, unfortunately, you are the first house guest to be evicted from the Big Brother house. When we get back to the house, you will make your way to the DR. Let's head back to the Big Brother house. Roxco88 Hawaii team for the opportunity to play and um I'll be back um I'll be back <laughs> all right house all right. guests the competition is over the winner will now enter from the DR uh, uh, it's nerve wracking because I don't know. I did not agree with Jay putting on telling Master Fire to put himself on the block because, like, if, if Jay loses the comp, not it's not really good for my game. 
then again, I'm one of the reasons why I smooths on the block where he and where he is because smooth is a good job piece. And right now, I know that he's gonna win over me in the like, especially if I with him. But then again, if he stays, like he's not gonna suspect suspect anything. And like either way, it's it's beneficial for my game. Whoever stays, but like I prefer Jay because I think our final two alliance is gonna help us get further in the game and work with Master Fi and hopefully dominate this game. I'm just really hoping he comes to those doors. So Smooth has won the competition, meaning that Jay is the first to be evicted from the house. So which means MacArthur's reign is now over. And one of you will be crowned the next head of household. H have a good night, house guests. Uh, sucks, because I, I, Jay is probably my closest ally in the game. And I know, like, I feel really bad for Jay. Like, I really think we can prevent this. I told Jay we shouldn't come on the block, but, like, it's whatever. It is. It's, it's, it is. And I still have an alliance with Smith, so hopefully me and him can be stay trustworthy together and hopefully get far in this game. No, we still have a chance to dominate, but like it really sucks. Jay was one of my closest close in the game. We were the newbie squad. We were back stars, but like now it is gone. Like I'm alone. And I figure I work around here to make sure I stay in the game. Next time on Big Brother Minecraft. After Jay was sent home, who will be the next head of household for the week? And who will be nominated for eviction? Also, how would JP do without his alliance partner Jay? And will the vets take power of the house? Stay tuned on Sunday, July 8th to watch everything go down. From outside the Big Brother Minecraft house, my name is Robster. Good night.